Analysts predict that in the next five years, we will create more than double the amount of data produced since the dawn of the digital age. A modern data strategy plays a foundational role in delivering AI and ML-led digital transformation for our customers across virtually every industry you can imagine. Today, I'm delighted to be joined by Kale Temple, a partner in data and AI at Deloitte. Welcome, and thanks for joining, Kale. Thanks for having me, Saka. Kale, um, there has obviously been a significant step function change in the last six months or so with artificial intelligence. Generative AI has taken the world by storm. What do you think are the big bets for generative AI in public sector? So I think there's going to be three different buckets around how generative AI is going to impact public sector. And the first one's going to be around the citizen experience. And this is going to be around where it's going to be used to enhance how the government is going to deliver its services through improved navigation, search and information retrieval on its websites. And so an example of this would be a chatbot that sits on a website where a user is looking to make a query. And rather than them having to trawl through different pages of content to try and find at that critical information, they can simply interact with that chatbot and get that answer on the tip of their fingers. The second is going to be in terms of document review and generation. And this is going to be where generative AI's ability to ingest and index information across different unstructured data sources, such as text and images, and then recall it in a structured way is going to be able to help drive efficiencies and improved accuracy across different processes. So an example of this is that different government departments have many receipts and forms and other types of data sources that they need to process. And generative AI will be able to ingest those and, and process them in an accelerated fashion, driving enhanced productivities. The third is around policy and compliance. And this is going to be where generative AI is going to be able to perform summarization and thematic search on different documents to expedite the review and analysis of them. And so an example of this is where an investigator is looking to perform a review of a, of a submission. And the generative AI solution is able to be a second set of eyes, which is able to um, flag that critical information that they need to review in accelerated fashion. That was really great information, Kale. Uh, where can our customers find more information on generative AI? Thanks, Sackett. So Deloitte's recently released a white paper called Why AI? Trend Drivers for AI Adoption in Public Sector. And so if you're looking to find out more information, please check out that report. That is fantastic. Thank you so much, Cal, for joining us today. Thank you for watching, and we will see you next time. Thanks again for your time, Cal. Thanks, Sackett. Okay.